Welcome back, workshop enthusiasts. We're just at shoppingguy.com, and today we are in the lifestyle. In this video, two portable generator brands will be going hand to hand. We have the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator and the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator. As extreme weather becomes easier to predict and prepare for, portable generators have risen in the market. If you live in a suburban area that's often hit by strong hurricanes and storms, followed by power outages, these units will be helpful in keeping your home warm and properly lit. Aside from this, you can use these machines to fuel outdoor camping and cookouts. In today's review, we have picked two of our strongest contenders, the Duro Max Dual Fuel Portable Generator, which has garnered a 5-batch rating, and its close competitor, the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator, which has earned a 4-batch rating. To find your best bet, these two options will be rumbling in today's brand wars. If you're interested in the other portable generators that we reviewed, do check out our portable generator review video link below. If you want direct links to the products themselves, all these links are also listed below too. So without further ado, let's start the brand wars. The first category that these portable generators will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their size and weight. Since these generators will be used on the go, knowing their size and weight will be one of the most important tasks. You can expect these powerful machines to be lightweight, but you can expect some units to be heavier than others due to the varying powers of their motors. Typically, a portable generator has a frame of 40 inches in length, width and height with a weight of 250 to 300 pounds. The Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator has a built-in height of 33 inches, a length of 30 inches, and a width of 35 inches. With this, you can conveniently mount them behind bigger appliances such as refrigerators or standing air conditioners. It also has a weight of 380 pounds, which is heavier than the average weight. But its challenger, the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator, is quite a hefty one. This option has the same built as the Duromax, but its weight is 540 pounds, requiring two to four people to carry it around. Both of these contenders have rubberized wheels for easy transport and a fold-down clip to keep them in position. But the 380-pound weight of the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator is easy to carry around alone, so we're giving it the first win of the match. The second category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their power. The main reason generators have a large profile is their power. This feature is a defining facet that'll tell you how efficient your machine is going to be in the event of a power outage. Though portable generators may not be able to keep all the appliances in your house running, it's still important to employ one that can provide energy for as many devices as possible. The standard rating for a portable generator starts at 5,000 to 7,500 watts to keep necessary items like ventilation systems and light providers running, but our two competitors raise the bar. The Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator has a peak power of 15,000 watts and a running power of 12,000 watts. With this, the generator can handle even high amperage power tools and heavy loads of electric output from an air conditioner, refrigerator, and lights. The Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator geared up strongly, though. This option has 20,000 running watts and 28,000 peak watts, so you can expect it to provide enough power to simultaneously support kitchen appliances such as ovens and microwaves and comfort-providing appliances such as high-power air conditioners, air fresheners, refrigerators, and drinking cellars. In this round, the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator has surpassed the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator, making it the winner of the power category. The third category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their running time and gas tank capacity. The main source of portable generator power is their gas tank. This will also determine how long the portable generator can last, so it's better to place your bet on a bigger tank since it'll provide electricity for a longer period even without refueling. Generally, portable generators have a fuel tank that's efficient enough to power your home or event for 5-10 to 10 hours. Once again, our two contenders went above and beyond by placing an offer that's greater than the average, starting with the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator that has a 10.8-gallon tank. With this, the unit can provide electricity for up to 10 hours, so you won't be sleeping with cold feet or waking up to a pillow of sweat. On the other hand, our bigger challenger, the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator, has a 17.7-gallon tank bestowing power for up to 11 hours. This is perfect as a backup for longer events such as overnight parties, camps, and even conventions and conferences. This fight is a very close clash between our two strong competitors, and though the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator started this league strong, we'd have to give the point to the larger tank of the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator, which offered an extra hour of electrical support. The fourth category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their available outlets. With multiple outlets, you can increase the spread of power by allowing multiple plug-ins. This is also perfect in case your household appliance has a specific ampere demand. For example, heating, ventilation, and air conditioning systems typically use 30 amperes, while 50 amperes are used more for ranges such as kitchen stoves. For the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator, you'll be getting two ground fault circuit interrupter or GFCI protected outlets to prevent electrical fire and user shock. 
to 30 ampere outlets for split type air conditioners and heat pumps and some 50 ampere outlets for multiple intense lights and kitchen appliances. The Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator offers the same selection, but this one offers 4 GCFI instead of 2, 3 30 ampere outlets instead of 2, and 2 50 ampere outlets instead of 1. This option will be extremely handy if you're hosting shows, mini concerts, or small plays. In this round, we recognize the extra measures that the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator delivers by awarding it a well-deserved point. The fifth and final category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their noise level. Any machine that's fulfilling a huge role will take a lot of effort to work, resulting in a faint buzzing sound. Portable generators are not an exception. To make sure you won't damage your hearing while your generator is on, try to stay at least 10 feet away from your generator. For the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator, the device usually starts off quiet, but around the 15-minute mark, the noise gets a bit louder. Its record starts with 78A weighted decibels, which is similar to what a washing machine that has been used for two hours sounds like. The Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator is a bit below its competitor with its 74A weighted decibel record. This is similar to what a dishwasher sounds like after about half an hour of use. With the power it creates and provides, this level of noise is already considered the quietest option. Our two contenders are unstoppable in creating noise, but it'll be easier to trust the lower noise level of the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator, so we're giving it the medal for this round. We have now come to the end of our fierce battle between the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator and the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator. Though the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator started the match with a win, it's unrelated the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator was dedicated to bouncing back stronger than the last encounter. Through tough punches and rigorous punches, the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator won the remaining four rounds, making it the new king of portable generators. And there you have it, folks. The battle between the Duromax Dual Fuel Portable Generator and the Westinghouse Outdoor Portable Generator has finally ended. If you have any contenders for our next portable generator face-off, which you would like our team to test, do drop it in the comments section below, and we'll be sure to assess them for our next update. If you liked this video and it helped you in any way, please do give it a like and hit the subscribe button so that you can stay connected and updated with all of our research into everything that makes our workshops great. We look forward to seeing you at the trustedshoppingguide.com again soon.